Hello, Brave Awakened Ones. This is Veronica of High Rum Holistics, Lady V. Thank you, supporters, subscribers, and Patreons. Please share these videos with those who you think it might resonate with. If you're interested in any of my services, books, merch, t-shirts, webinars, sessions, and higher realm magic information and meditations, please visit higherrealmholistics.com. Good evening, Brave Awakened Ones. Queen V here. What's up? It is the 28th. Yes, it is. It's still the 28th of January 2020. 2000, 2020. Duh. Um, I just had a very, a very stimulating conversation with a, an adorable little nine-year-old boy in, in Winnie the Pooh jammies in the elevator. Um, he was fascinated by my uh, Marvel Comics tote bag. Yes, I'm a comic book nerd. And uh, we just had the most stimulating conversation about the fall of Marvel Comics. But, you know, hey, we're talking about at least they're doing Scarlet Witch movie. They might be coming out with that. And they're they coming out with the um, with the uh, Black Widow movie. So it was, he was so excited. He would, did not want to let me go. I got out before him and he was just like, oh, it was so cool talking to you. Because like, I'm sure his mom does not talk about Marvel Comics. But thought I'd share that. You know, they're so adorable when they're not yours. <laughs> Any which ways. I don't want to beat a dead horse. No pun intended, of course. Um, but there's a couple of things that I'm so happy people are picking up on when it comes to the Kobe Bryant deal. And, um, yeah, there was a, her and beyond that, there was a horrific earthquake right in between the hit in the waters, right in between Cuba and Jamaica. And yeah, we felt it down here in South Florida, but, um, yeah, I knew something was up. Didn't know what it was, but I had many sessions to do and a lot of work to do. So I was like, let me pull through. And then my last session, I just two hours knocked out, but like crying in pain, horrible. My bones hurt. My whole body was shaking, teeth chattering. And um, I, it was the earthquake. It was 7.7, .7, pretty bad. Um, but hopefully everything's okay. I have to check on my peeps in Jamaica, see what's going on there. Um, but I'm sure it's not bad because it was in the waters. Excuse me. Any which way. So that happened. There's going to be many rumblings. You know, they've been messing with Harp in Puerto Rico really hard because they, the dark ones, they need something real bad to happen. And yes, I'm sticking to my story that Kobe's still alive. I totally believe that, 100%. Um, and in my nap, I was taken out to this island. And it was not just one little island. It was these little islands off the coast of California. Like, literally, it was like a weird... Uh, let me show you what it looked like. A map. First things first, make sure I switch my cameras. Yes, we'll hit the Schumann. Just to give that encouragement, we still got this. We're still in power. Okay, guys, peaked at 54. Like I said, it's not ever going back. To, it's, not, it's not going back, okay? 3D is not going to happen. Never mind 2D where they're trying to drag us into. Straight into the depths of hell, not going to happen. 4D strong, higher 4D and 5D. It, it's all there, okay? So, with that being said, yeah, firstly, no black box on the helicopter. They're saying because it wasn't required on that model. But I was listening to one of the Truther channels, and one of the Anons said for the older model of this helicopter, the black box was not required. But the year that his helicopter was made, because it's a B model, it was required. So they're trying to play tricks, right? They're, they're shenanigans, more shenanigans, okay? And like I was saying, now they're coming out saying that, oh, it was a chartered helicopter. That's why it was the white and blue. Really? Didn't I tell you guys that that BS was going to happen? They were going to come up with that BS. Because all over the place when it first happened, it was his 
personal helicopter, Kobe's private helicopter. And then people are sending me messages, putting messages. Oh, it's because it was a wrap, so it was all burnt off because, you know, they put on wraps. But he missed me with that nonsense. Okay, give me a break. Really? Not a speck of the black is there? Stop it. Stop it. Because remember the bait blades also. Stop it. No. Okay? Not biting it. Not at all. Oh, we're going to hit this one later. Now, here's an example of one of the islands off of the coast of California. Here's the map. Here's Calabasas right here. Calabasas is over here. Then you have LA. And then you have all these little islands right here. Okay? And that's why I was shown was Celebrity Island. Um, I was taken out there. Here's a, a drawing. And here's another one. And what I was shown was... Yeah, the bigger natural ones, they kind of use for tourism, but there's some that are a little further. Oh, I'm getting it again. Yes. There's some that are for a little further out, but you see how it's located right by the airport. It is right here in this vicinity. Um, they're man-made. They're not natural. Like here's an example of, of a couple of them. And like I said, they're on an island, but they're inside the freaking island. I was shown it. It's like they're in there. They're there. Okay. So they're on these islands in the Pacific off the coast of the LA region. But it like there's a few of them. Like there's some up further north. There's a little further like, but some of them are artificial. They're man-made. But some are natural and they're all hilly. They're all rock total like little mountains little hills and they're inside so that's where they're hiding out and that's where they go and yet um a lot of the anons they're putting out there and i've known this before before any of this um when kobe first started getting in trouble for alleged rape charges blah blah and stuff like that um when i was you know looking up things on him years ago with the whole 33 degree Mason thing. Um, so he, he was on the same board of some not nonprofit, whatever BS with, with Epstein, but Jeffrey Epstein, he also was working with the Clintons and the Clinton foundation. And of course it all revolves around children it's the wrong kids. That's all I have to say about that. So, you know, wake up, people. If you're thinking this guy was some type of freaking hero. Mm -mm. No, he was one of them. And because of what he was involved in, also, from what I heard, the whole board that he was on with Epstein had to do with um, what Epstein was up to when it comes to the whole genetics thing and all this kind of craziness. I'm not going to go too into it, but you know what I'm talking about. Do your research. You'll see what I'm talking about. He was in all of that. He was in all of it. So this is where they're hiding out, these islands over here. This is where they go. When, like like, like everyone saw, he, he passed the torch to LeBron, right? He passed the torch over to LeBron because now he's going to be the front face. He's going to be the face. All right. So because things got hot, he took one for the team. Like I said, look at, look at what's going on TV. Everything is coronavirus or Kobe. It's all you're seeing nonstop all over the place, all over the world. Right. With, and please stop sending me videos on the coronavirus with doctors and nurses dropping in stuff. Really? Again, Yes, China would do something like that to their people, test out their bio stuff, and maybe there's a couple of cases splattered here and there, but I think it's the same nonsense that's been going on. And there, you know, Bill Gates did a, did a dry run on the whole coronavirus thing. And yes, his strand that he has a patent on is different from the strand that they say is running wild right now. Same shit, okay? bait and switch sort of thing oh it's not the exact same thing still please don't send me any of those because i'm not buying any of it 
All right, it's like Godzilla. Ah! That's what it looks like to me, really. That's exactly what it looks like to me. The nurse is screaming and crying. And I'm sure, you know, China would have no problem experimenting on their people. No problem. And I'm sure they're doing something crazy like that. But I think it's the same nonsense as everything else with the SARS and the Zika and the this and the that and blah, 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 every six months or so. Just don't feed into the energy, okay? All right, so we got that. Celebrity islands out here. And it's not just celebrities, of course, that go out here. You have politicians, you know, a lot of the ones that we, the dark ones that we don't see, that no one ever sees. They're hiding out in these little islands. I see like in the middle of the Pacific, further out. I mean, the more important you are, the further out you are to keep you safe, whatever. That's that's the crap they're pulling. But you know what? Watch, there's going to be bombs, explosions. They're going to be knocked out the park. All right, that's what's going to happen. Now, what woke me up out of my slumber was this insanity. I was like, really? Ilhan Omar, she's a representative who's been causing lots of trouble here in the States, okay? Some say that she's, uh, you know, she's obviously one of the dark ones, but some say that she's a, a spy, a plant, right? She's from Somalia. Uh, she's what, in Wisconsin causing a lot of trouble, and now she's under investigation for marrying her brother to, to get him uh, a quick visa because it's, it takes longer to get other family members uh, visas and green cards than it, than it would a spouse or a child. So that's why she, quote unquote, married her brother. Um, but she was already married, so now she's in trouble for bigamy and all that kind of nonsense and, you know, tax fraud and all these other federal charges that she's in trouble for, faces deportation. Now... What I was woken out my son before was that Miss Thing, Miss Thing, who, not for nothing, if they ship her ass back to Somalia, she will get stoned as a Muslim because uh, she was cheating with uh, with some white dude. <laughs> Come on now. You're married to your brother. You have a husband who left her, by the way, and... And then you cheat with some white dude who's who's like your your PR guy. Come on now. So any which ways, mm, what's going on underneath this this uh, jihad whatever that she has on her head? What's underneath your scarf, lady? So what my oversoul woke me up with? I said, really, I need to see this crap. Uh, it was a remote view, and she's planning with her people to do this press conference very soon. Like they were coming up with the wording. She was rehearsing, they were rehearsing her really, really good. Uh, so she's gonna come out in the press conference and she's going to drop the mother of all bomb victim cards. Cause we all know that's what they're doing, right? They're trying to make everybody into victims. So she's gonna play that victim card. Uh, women of color, Muslim women of color. Oh my God. An abused was abused by men, Muslim women of color. So she's gonna really throw it on. She's gonna lay it on real thick. And oh my God! And and yes, and I've suffered so much. And they did this out of their goodness of the heart. The whole bait and switch. You know, no, my name is not that. It's that because of the abuse I was going under. Oh, remember what I'm saying here, okay? Because of the abuse, I'm going under. And now I come here seeking asylum. And now Trump, more white men, never mind you, screwing some other woman's husband who's a white dude. Uh, now the Trump, this horrible white man, is abusing me. I'm going under more abuse. And, and it, you know, oh, 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 save me. Feel sorry for me. Feel sorry for me. Victim, victim, victim. That's the, that's the nonsense she's going to pull. Is it going to work? No. No, it's not going to work. The Muslim people are going to be pissed off as hell at her. She's going to be scared half to death to be shipped out. But, yeah, the whole lot of them are going to get gathered up and, and kicked out. Yeah, her and her whole, whole crew is going to be discovered. 
So that's what's going on. She's going to play the victim card. She's going to cry. She's going to say that, oh my God, she's being abused and she came here for asylum. And the reason why she had to do this was to save her family. She had no choice. She's going to be called out. Plain and simple. There's going to be plenty of people out there who, no matter what, ridiculous SJWs with way too much Kool-Aid in their hair that seeped in and, and mushed up their brain are going to buy into it. And, you know, she's she's with the whole George Soros crew. They're going to come out in force with their pickets and their signs saying, save Ilhan, blah, 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 this kind of nonsense. But it's all coordinated. There's no one out there in that crowd that's for real. Let's put it that way. Not a single person. They're all brought and paid for. You will see. Okay? So that's the deal. That's what I was shown with her. I was just told to get that message out there because it's going to happen real soon. Okay? Major eye-rolling event. All right? We'll just have a chuckle. Shits and giggles. Yeah, <laughs> basically. We'll have a good laugh at that one. All righty then. Lady V out. No, Queen V out. All right. Goodbye, my kings and queens. Have a good night. And I haven't given you sugar in a while. Sugar. Bye.